Hey guys, it's Jamie getting out the farm and it never fails <clears throat> on the nastiest day that you can think of. You know, you're gonna have animals uh, deliver babies. So we knew that Barbie was expecting. Her due date wasn't till the 29th. Last year, or last farrowing, she went over by two days. So this time I really was expecting her to go over by two days also, but she didn't. She decided to deliver in the rain today. And it's not pouring now, but it has rained all day long. It's 64 degrees here. Last week, it was beautiful, sunny, and 92 a couple of days. And this week, it's been dreary, rained almost every day. And today, it's dreary, cloudy, rainy, and 64 degrees. So hang out with me. We'll ride down. I'll give you a look at them. We scrambled and made a makeshift shelter. She's kind of laying half under, half out. The pigs are with her. The piglets are with her. And she had a bunch. It is a bunch, I'm telling you. Uh, last time she had 10, she beat that this time. So hang out, let's go. Get down, you're muddy. Get down, you're muddy. Shoo, shoo. here feeding and just was not expecting to see any piglets and there they were so i built this makeshift shelter here in the middle as you can see and we'll just see how that goes so luckily barbie's a really gentle pig and we can handle her and we can actually move those piglets around a little bit i kind of moved them into this little area here she still hadn't got completely under it, but a little bit's better than nothing. The rain has slowed down some, but I just can't believe she had them early. I can believe it, really. She had them uh, early because it was raining <laughs> and to make it hard on the farmer. So here's these piglets. So last time Barbie delivered, whew, sat down and got my tail wet. Last time Barbie delivered for us, she was an amazing mom. And she had 10, one stillborn, and weaned nine. You'll never believe she had 15. 15 piglets. I think that's why she went early, is because she had 15. Go on now. I think she delivered early because she just was full. She had 15 piglets. One of them was born stillborn. And one of them actually uh, had walked, got enough to get away from the nest, probably 15 feet and got cold and looked like it had died. So that's what worries me. She's a good mama. Thirteen piglets. Can't believe it. So I really can't believe that she had thirteen. And number one, I can't believe she's waited till it was raining. Her due date would have been Saturday. It would have been beautiful, sunny, and seventy-eight degrees or seventy-three degrees or something. But is she gonna wait for that? Absolutely not. She's gonna have them in the worst weather she can. That's this kind of farmer's luck, I guess. Uh, 
I moved him over here to this shelter and it looks like she is going to use it some. Hopefully she will get in there and lay down and keep them dry a little bit. So guys, if you're looking for pasture pigs and you're looking for pigs to start a pasture pig program, you need to buy pigs that are raised like this. If you buy pigs that are born um, in a confinement or raised in confinement, never on pasture, uh, the good chance that they won't survive on a rainy day if they have them. What I'm trying to say is if you're going to start a pig operation, a pasture pig operation, and you want the farrow on pasture, live on pasture, and uh, have them stay on pasture, then you need to buy your pigs that you're expecting to breed from someone who raises pigs this way so just keep that in mind when you go out looking for your piglets buy them from someone who's going to uh, take care of them or run them the way you are rainy rainy day but we got 13 beautiful little piglets let's hope they all make it she's a really good mom so i think she'll do a good job with them they'll get milk drunk here in a second and be asleep well guys, it's been a crazy day. An unexpected delivery of 15 piglets, 13 of which are still alive. So it's a good day, good day on the farm, nasty day on the farm, but a good day on the farm. So uh, thoughts and prayers that they all make it. You know, there's gonna be more baby piglet videos. Not much cuter than a baby piglet running around, that's for sure. As always guys, thanks for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe. We'll do it all again tomorrow and we'll have some baby pigs to do it with. Have a good one. Hey guys, this is Jamie again. I just wanna to add to yesterday's video a little bit. We had storms come through last night. We had them in a shelter. We had, you know, some straw in there. Uh, they seemed to stay dry, but we lost two last night. We had tornado warnings, we had wind, we had power outages in the, uh, around the county, and uh, it was just an awful night. We got almost three inches of rain in about 12 to 14 hours. The sun's finally out, as you can see now. And uh, I tell you, it's just, it's just been, it's just been a rough, rough few days. So it's been a rough, I just tell you, it was a really rough night. Uh, you know, when you're raising livestock and you're not putting them in the houses and barns, things happen. We lost two last night. So we went from a 15 down to 11. Uh, and there was 11 are doing well, you can see in the video. I know I'm probably going to take some grief over uh them being outside but you know that is what it is and we'll just keep going and we'll see you on the next one we'll do it all again tomorrow hope better results this time